Hi everyone, it's Joanna here. Welcome to another home workout. How are you coping? I hope that you are still staying active with my videos. So today's workout is a total body strength training workout. But the thing is that you won't need any equipment at all. So you can do this at home in a very small space. So what we're doing is that we're using your body, your own body as resistance. So there will be a total of eight exercises, okay? We want to be counting down. The first set, the goal is to complete 20 reps and then going down to 15 reps, 10 reps and five reps. Let's start with a quick warm up. Let's start by standing shoulder width apart with your toes pointed forward and let's get into a nice deep squat and a reverse lunge. So alternating between legs, left and right. Good. Squat down and push it back. Nice. There you go. Keep going. Reverse lunge. Squat down and back. Good. Try to drive your knee closer to the ground, okay? And just relax your upper body. Last one more. Down, back, on the other side, squat down and back. Good. Now, what I want to do is just tap side to side, okay? Just again, warming up our body and just opening up your chest and your back muscles as well, okay? So tap side to side and feel the stretch on your upper body. Keep going. A few more. Tap, tap, tap and tap. Good. Okay, now step right at the edge of your mat. Let's get down into inchworm, into a plank. Give me one push up and back up. All right? If you can, try to keep your legs straight throughout the entire movement and you will feel the stretch on your hamstrings. Up, back down, give me two more. Into a push-up, back up, straight, last one more, down, into a push-up and back up. All right, now let's stretch our hip flexor out a little bit, okay? So what I want to do is come down, get into a high plank, take your right leg forward and just open up, back into a high plank and now on the left side. Reach your arms straight up to the ceiling. Good. The other side, open up. Back into a high plank. Stretch it out. Last few more. Give me two more. Okay, right side. Last final set. Left, stretch it out. And slowly inch yourself back up. Okay, do you feel your body warmed up? We're going to start with the first round, okay? For the first round, it's going to be 20 repetitions. So we're going to start with our lower body. The first workout is going to be a lateral square walk. So the goal here is to stay in a low squat position throughout. So stand shoulder width apart with your toes pointed forward. Stay, start in a low squat and walk left to right, okay? Ready? Let's go. Start low. Left to right is one. Good, and that's two. What I would say is place both arms just by the side of your head. This way, you will make sure that you're keeping your chest up. And stay low. Seven, good. Go wider, eight. Nice, feel the squeeze on your thighs, your glutes. Every part of your legs should be working and stay low. Give me eight more. One, two, go wider, okay? Three, four, five, chest up and stay low. Three more. One, two, last one more. Three, good, okay. The first set, the first round is going to be the most challenging round. And I promise you, it will get easier after this. That's what she says. All right. Second lower body workout, lunge to curtsy, okay? If you have done my live workout last two weeks, 
you will know this workout. It's a killer. So step back into a lunge position and then cross into a curtsy. All right, that is one. So we're going for 20. So just working on our right side to begin with. Step right at the front of your mat. Ready? Let's go. Step back, lunge. Drive your knee as low as you can towards the floor. Two. With strength training workout, you don't have to rush through the workout. Really slow the pace down. Engage your muscles, okay? It's about the mind and body connection. Feel the work and the tension on your legs and your glutes. Seven. Don't worry, I'm counting. Eight. Nine, go low. 10. Okay, if you need to, you can come back up for a while. Take three breaths and get back down for another 10 more. One, good. Two, halfway there. Three, look straight ahead. Push down. Four. So as you get into a curtsy, it will work more on your glutes and your outer thighs. Oh, I can already feel the burn. Last four more. Let's go, three more. Three. Last two. Woo! One more. One. Cross and up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Shake your legs out, okay? We have worked on our right side. Now, let's not forget our left leg. All right, so start right in front of your mat. Take your right step back, down, and cross, okay? Very good, back down and cross. Look straight ahead. Breathe out as you come up. Six, nice. Seven, if at all you feel like you need to take a short break, come back up, take two deep breaths and get back down, okay? So we're halfway there, get back up, breathe in, breathe out, shake it out a little bit, let's get back down and finish the remaining 10. Take a wide lunge, two, three, good, four, I can feel your burn, five, Woo, go low, six, ah, stay with me, seven, Eight, nine, last one more, 10, and back up. Oh, you are going to get a short break for your lower body. Let's get down onto the mat and work on our upper body. The next workout is going to be a narrow to a wide push-up, okay? So the narrow push-up is going to work on your triceps, and the wide push-up will work on your chest muscles. All right, let's start with a narrow push-up. Lower yourself down, push your elbow back, get into a wide push-up, down, and push yourself back up. Okay, so nice and easy. Down and wide, that is four. If you want more challenge, what you can do is explode. Jump out and in, good. Out and in. Halfway there. Really making sure that both elbows are pointed back when you're in a narrow push up position. Good. Six more. Down. Up. Four more. Push it back. Last two more, okay? Narrow. Go as low as you can and explode. Go low and push yourself up. All right. Still working on our upper body, focusing on your back muscles as well as your core and your shoulders. Let's get down into a superman, superman squeeze and a plank. So lie on your belly, keep your legs straight and flat onto the ground, spread them apart a little bit. What I want to do is get into a superman position, squeeze your back muscles for two count, place both palms next to your chest and push yourself up in one straight line. Remember, it's not peeling yourself off the floor. This is wrong. 
in a low position, push yourself up, tuck your toes under, straight up, okay? Challenge yourself. Let's go. Superman, up, squeeze, hands by your chest, push up and down. 20 reps. Squeeze, tuck your toes and down. If this is too challenging, what you can do is get up onto your knees and back down. Okay, choose your option. Squeeze up to your knees and down. Very good. Remember, hold the squeeze for two counts and up. Nice. Gaze gently onto the floor. Lift your chest off. Lift your thighs off the floor. Squeeze, hold it and push back up. Good job, guys. Keep going. Squeeze. Push up. This is the first set. So you might still be getting used to the movements, but that is absolutely fine. We have three more sets to go. Halfway there. Push up. Give me 10 more, okay? Squeeze, palms by your chest, straight up. And remember, straight back down. Do not collapse. Push up, back down. Squeeze, straight up, okay? Very good. Six more. Oh, remember that every time you feel like giving up, that's when you should give yourself that little bit of push and because that's how you're going to progress, okay? Last three more. Strong arms, strong upper body, strong core. Last one more. Back down. Squeeze every inch. Squeeze up. And just shake it out, okay? Stretch a little bit if you need to. Stretch it out. And come back up, okay? Next, we want to work on our lower body again. So it's going to be a single leg lunge. This can be a little bit of a challenge because it's going to work on your balance as well. So let's start on our right leg, okay? What I'm going to do is find that firm foundation, lift your left leg off the floor, bend your knee, bend your right knee, and tap onto the floor. As you come up, squeeze your glutes, okay? Let's aim for 20. Right, ready? Let's go. Down, tap, and squeeze it right at the top. Slow it down as you lower yourself. Squeeze, create more tension. Lower down and squeeze, good. Bring your body down. Remember to keep your back flat all the time. So do not hunch, okay? Looking straight ahead. Nice, squeeze and engage your core. Suck your belly in and squeeze. If this is too challenging, what you can do is as you, as you come up, take a small tap Release and lower yourself back down. Good, 12 more. Bend your knee, tap gently and up. And up, last 10 more. Bend and up, good. All right, don't rush through the workout. Find one focal point and just look at that point throughout, good. Remember to breathe out as you come up. Last five more. Squeeze. Four more. Up, squeeze. Just working on one side at a time. Three. Last two more. Last one more. Down and squeeze. Very good. Okay, right leg done. You know what's next. Left side, okay? There is going to be a little bit more challenge on your left leg, especially for me. I struggle to find my balance on this side. All right, let's go. Again, lift your right leg off, lower your body down, tap, and come back up. Okay, the goal is to find your balance as well. Tighten your core because we want to really strengthen our core. The core is the foundation to your body. The stronger your core is, the stronger you will be performing in all your other workouts. Five, good. Slow it down, lower, bend your knees. Six, good. Squeeze your glutes right at the top. Squeeze, 
Nice. 12 more. Very good. Halfway there. If you need to, take a short break. Tap, count to three, and lower yourself back down. Okay, halfway there. You have eight more reps. Slow it down, bend your knee. <sighs> Breathe out. Five more. Woohoo! <laughs> Down, squeeze. Oh, all the work just on one leg. Last three. Two more. So, with all these exercises, it is low impact, but it is extremely effective in toning up and sculpting your muscles. Okay, done. Okay, the next. Workout, we still want to work on our glutes, okay? So lie down onto the mat. Bring your hips up into a bridge position. But instead of doing the normal bridge, what I want you to do is let both heels meet inwards and then point your knees outwards, okay? Place both palms down. And same thing, lower your butt down and squeeze it right at the top. This will activate your glutes even more. Down, squeeze, back down, and up. Remember to hold it for at least one to two counts right at the top. Good. Up and down, good. Imagine there's a string pulling you through right in the middle of your belly button. Halfway there, let's give me 10 more. Good. Last eight, squeeze, keep going. Don't stop right now. Up, last five more. One, let's count together. Two, three. And for the final rep, I want you to just hold it right at the top and count one, two, three, four, and five. And lower it down, okay? Ah, just shake your legs out a little bit. Okay, now gently come back up. Short rest for your legs, back to our upper body. Next is going to be a really interesting push-up. It's going to be dwarfing push-ups. Again, working on the strength of your triceps, your shoulders, as well as your core, okay? So let's get into a low plank position. And what I want you to do is pike your butt up and slowly lower yourself back down, okay? making sure that both elbows are pointed back. Ready, let's go. Pike it up and back down. Push it up and back down. If this is too challenging, what you can do is start in a high plank position and pike your butt up, okay? This is an easier option. If not, get back down and let's continue the workout. Pike it up, do the work on your triceps, and your shoulders, pike it up, push it up, staying on your toes, and push it up. Very good. Okay? Keeping a strong and firm plank. So do not dip or arch your back. And breathe out as you pike your butt up. Breathe out, pushing your arms, pushing your triceps to help you. Give me 10 more. Push it up, down. Feel your arms shaking. That is absolutely fine. Feel your entire body working. Okay, back down. Push it up. Okay, back down. Push it up. Down. Last five more. Back down, you are strong. Three, last two more. Two, stay with me. One more. Up and just drop. Okay. One final workout. One final workout and you will get a short break. And that is the end of the first round. All right, let's get back down, okay? Still in a low plank position. The final workout is going to be a plank up down. So push yourself up 
and down. That's one, okay? And we want to aim for 20. Good. Three. And four. Avoid moving your hips too much. So don't dip your hip. This is strong, okay? Engage your core. Slowly drop your body down and slowly lift it up. Alternating between the arms. Halfway there. Ten more. Spread your fingers apart if you need to. That will give you a stronger base. Last eight more. Down and up. Yes, it is more challenging for the first round. Stay strong. Stay with me. Last five more. Up. Last three. Last two. One more. And just press it out. Very well done. Just roll your arms. Give your arms a short break. Oh, that is the end of the first round. Take a short break, keep yourself hydrated, and we want to move on to the second round. Very well done. All right, let's move on to the second set. We want to repeat the entire circuit again, but this time, 15 reps, okay? So let's do this. Let's start in a low squat position. Let's go left and right. Good. Lateral squat walk. Two. Good. Three. Very nice. Stay low. Four. Five. As wide as you can. Six. Nice. It's all a low impact workout, but it's still very effective to build your muscles and to maintain a lean figure. Let's go. Ten more. One, two, three, four. Last one, okay, I've forgotten. It's only 15 reps. Five, 15, very good job. All right, now, lunge to curtsy, okay? So step right in front. Let's go, one lunge back. Curtsy, just working on your right side. Two, good, keeping a low lunge throughout. Three. Very good. Four. Stay low, stay with me. Ten more. Seven. Eight. Nine. Crossover. Ten. Last five more, okay? One. Two. Three. Last two more. Four. Last one more, five, and back up. Oh my gosh, my right thighs, I can really feel the burn. Okay, change side, okay? So, now let's work on our left thighs. Take a right step back, and cross. Making sure that your body is squared, facing forward throughout the entire workout. Three, Four, nice, five, keep going, six, if you need to, you can come back up, take a short break, and back down, okay? And ten, okay, we're not there yet, okay? Five more, let's go, one, two, cross, last three, three, feel the burn, Four, last one more. You got this, five, and ah. Oh. Take a short break, give your thighs a nice pad, and let's get back down onto the floor for our upper, upper body circuit. Okay, narrow to wide push up, okay? Only 15 times. Let's go, narrow. That's two, three, four, nice. Keep going, six. Nice, really push your triceps back and work on your triceps. Eight, last five more. One, wide, three, push it down, 
Drive your chest down, push your triceps back, and push yourself back up. Okay, good. Now, lie straight down onto the floor, okay? Superman squeeze to plank. Working on your back muscles, your core muscles, and your glutes. Up, squeeze, one. Palms next to your chest, push yourself up. Up, squeeze, two. Back down, squeeze, nice. Remember, your entire body should be coming up in one straight line. Very good, there you go. Give me 10 more, okay? You got this. Back down, control yourself as you come down. Don't just collapse. Up, squeeze, nice. Six more, squeeze your back, feel your lats, six more. Oh. Last five, up, squeeze your lats for two counts. Last few more, squeeze, push up, three more. Last two. And one last one, let's go. Up, squeeze, push yourself back up, and up. Okay, very, very well done. Now, time for a short break for your upper body. Let's get back down and work on your lower body, okay? Single leg lunge. All right, if you find that this is too challenging, you can always place your leg onto your table or a chair if you need to. Okay, so left leg up, Work on your right thighs. Let's go down, bend your knee, up and squeeze. Tap down and squeeze. Only 15, okay? The trick here is to find one focal point and just focus on that spot. Very good. Up, last 10 more. Bend your knee. Breathe out as you come up. Breathe in as you lower yourself down. Tap if you need to. Good. Last five more. Find your balance. Last three more. Down, up, down, up. And last one more. Squeeze. Very, very good. Good job. Okay, change side. Now on our left leg, okay? So, same thing. Before you start, engage your core. Really engage your core throughout. Consciously suck your belly in. And let's go. Tap down and back up. Good. Tap down, back up. Again, for an easy option, tap your feet down. Bring it back up and tap your feet down, okay? Down and tap. Good, 10 more, let's go. One, lower yourself, bend your knee, don't rush through the workout. Good, lower and very good. The slower you do this workout, the more you will feel your glutes working. Let's get back down, up, woo! Last five more, okay? One, two, Three, last two more, go low. Four, one more, find your balance. And up. Okay, now let's get into a bridge pose, all right? So, bring your body down. Again, heels together, okay? Bring your glutes up, squeezing your glutes for two counts at the top. Place your palms down, and let's go for 15, okay? Tap, up, three, nice, four, five, let's bring up the speed slightly, one, two, three, as high as you can, four, imagine that's a string, pull your belly button, five, six, seven, eight, squeeze, nine, and last, ten. Very good. Okay, now, lower body 
Time for a short break. Moving on to our upper body. Okay, dolphin push-up. By now, you should know whether you hate or love this workout, okay? So let's get into a low plank position, all right? Remember again, throughout the entire workout, I want you to engage your core. So tighten your core, pack your butt up, back down, and up, okay? Look in between your legs. Nice, three, very good. Four, push it up. Feel the work in your triceps, your shoulders. Five, six, very good, halfway there. Breathe out as you come up. Very good, okay? Really engage your core, hold it for one count, and come right back down. Okay, last five more. One, two, push it. Three, control. Four, last one more, control, and Five, all right. Drop onto your knees. Take a short break, get into a child's pose. And we have one final workout, okay? It's going to pl be plank up, down. All right, ready? Last final workout and you are done with two sets. Let's go, up and down. That's one and that's two, okay? Avoid moving your hips side to side. Do not do this, this is wrong, okay? This workout is about working on your upper body as well as your core strength. Good, very good, you have eight more. Let's go. Spread your fingers apart if you want more balance. Last five more. Down, up, last three more. Last two more. And take a short break. Okay, two sets down. Two more to go. 10 reps and five reps, okay? Take a short break. So you have completed 20 reps, 15 reps, and this round is going to be only 10 reps. You know all the workouts by now. So give me your best effort. Start in a low squat. Let's go for lateral Squat, walk. Left and right. Two, good. Three, go low. Four, do not come up right now. Five, six, seven, eight. Last two more. Nine, go lower. Ten, very good. Okay, lunge to curtsy, okay? Only ten. Ready? Let's go. Lunge and curtsy. Good. So remember, open up your chest. Look straight ahead. Three. Feel the burn. Five. Halfway there. Six. Doing a good job. Seven. Eight. Take a wide lunge, okay? Nine. Cross. And ten. Cross. Good job. Okay, left side. All right, ready? Let's go. Take your right step back and cross. Step and cross. Okay, when you get into a lunge, you're working on your quads. And when you get into curtsy, you're working more on your glutes as well as your outer thighs. Last five. Four. Three. Two, last one more, one, and back up. Okay, your favorite push-ups. Narrow to wide push-up. Narrow push-up will be working on our triceps. Wide is for our chest. All right, let's go. Down, explode, and wide. Good. As long as you can, try to get your chest towards the floor. You have two more, one narrow, one wide. Wide and back up. Okay, Superman to plank. 
Okay, keep up with me. Short breaks right now. Squeeze and push yourself back up. Good, reach forward, squeeze and up. Very good. Nice. Remember to lift your chest off the floor, your hips off the floor and push yourself back up. Halfway there. Last five more. Squeeze. Up. Hold for one count. Up. Three more. Breathe out as you come up. All your energy and breathe out. Very good. Last one more. Squeeze and out. Good job. Let's get straight back up. Back to our lower body. Single leg lunge, okay? Starting on our right side. Find your balance. Let's go down and tap. Two. Very good. Squeeze right at the top. Squeeze. Three. Back down. Four. Squeeze. Straighten your legs. Five. Last five more. Six. Good. Seven. Last three more. Eight. Nine, one more, down and up. Very good, okay. Shake it out, change side, all right? Left leg now, okay? So, same thing. Bend your knee, lower yourself down and up. Let's go, two, squeeze, three, four, slow it down, five, very good. Halfway there, six, last four more. Breathe out as you come up, okay? So breathe in and breathe out. Last two more, bend. Last one more, slow it down and up. Okay, you know the next workout. Let's lie down onto the mat. It's going to be a heel touch glute bridge, okay? Spread your legs and up. One, two, gentle tap. Three, squeeze. Four, five, very good. Six, push your knees out. Seven, eight, last one more and you wanna hold it right at the top. Hold it, one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, back down. Straight into our upper body. Dwarfing push-up, okay? So get into a low plank position. If this is too tough, you can get into a high plank and pike your butt up, all right? This is a easier alternative. If not, get into a low plank and give me 10. Pike it up, keep your elbows pointed back, okay? Do not spread your elbows out. Three, good. And gaze gently on the floor and in between your legs. Last five more. One, two, remember pointing your elbows back. Three, palms on the floor. Four, last one more. And five, okay. All right, are we ready for the final workout? Plank, up, down, only 10 reps. All right, let's go. Low plank, up, one, two, good, three, strong core, four, five, good. And again, breathe out as you come up, okay? Last three more. Breathe out. Last one more, breathe out. And ha, you are done for round number three. Short break and the final circuit. Only five repetitions. You got this, okay? All right, this is your final set. You have made it all 
the way to this round, okay? Only five repetitions. Let's do it. Let's go. Lateral squat walk. One, two, very good. Easy, three. I'm sure you're looking forward to this. Four, last one, and five. Okay, lunge to curtsy, okay? Only five. This is a killer workout. I love this workout. One, two, very good. Go low, tap your knee onto the floor. Last two more, tap. Let's go, add more intensity, more work. Tap, and change to the other side. Left side, right leg back, tap. Only five, okay? So go as low as you can. Really give your muscle that good squeeze. Last one more. And back up. Narrow to wide push up. As you can see, I'm taking almost no break right now. Let's go one, wide. Really go narrow, go all the way wide. Give me last two more. And you are done. Superman squeeze to plank. Ready, squeeze and up. Back down, squeeze, push your entire body up. Two, squeeze, three, last two more team, last two more, squeeze, one more, and up. Okay, back to our lower body, single leg lunge, okay? Let's try not to rest our left foot at all. Ready, find your balance, let's go. One, squeeze, slow it down. Two, squeeze. I want you to really go slow as you go low. Three, squeeze, good. Go slow. Four, squeeze. Last one more. Up and squeeze. Okay, change side, okay? Left side. Let's go. One, Find your balance. Two, my left side is always more challenging. Three, squeeze. Four, last one more. And five. All right, down into a bridge position. Up, ready, down, spread your knees. One, two, hold for two counts. One, two, good. One, two, and last, give me 10 pulses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Very good. Okay, final upper body workout. Dolphin push up. Get into a low plank position, palms onto the floor, and pike it up. One, down, two, good, three, as high as you can, pike your butt up, four, last one more, and hold it right at the top, one, two, three, four, five, okay, one final workout, okay, plank up, down, let's go, start in a low plank, push yourself up, one, two, three, four, and five. You are done. Very, very well done. That was a total body strength training workout. 20 reps, 15 reps, all the way down to five reps. Give me a high five, okay? Be sure to stretch yourself out and do check out my other workout videos from explosive HIIT workouts, kickboxing, and even low impact workouts. If you enjoyed this video, do give this video a thumbs up, share this video on, and stay home, stay safe, and stay active. I will see you in my next workout session. All the best.